Oh guys, just a quick update on blood flow. As you can see now, we've got some new tiles. Uh, we've got some random levels. Every level is different. I'm just going to try and complete this one and just show you what it's all about. So you can see here we've got some bombs. They will actually destroy tiles um, within a one tile radius. We've got some blank actors there. We've got some actors that cannot be uh, rotated. They're fixed. Sure, that one's in the right place. That one there. Oops, <laughs> I think I've messed it up. And as you can see there, if you plant a bomb in the wrong place and it blows up the actual blood flow, um, then it's game over. So let's just try and uh, complete this level. Uh, the cool thing about it, obviously, is infinite levels, and um, the user can carry on playing. We've actually put some rewards in as well. Um, so if you complete so many levels, you collect so many items. These won't actually be stars in the finished game. We're going to go for amulets and keys um, and bats to collect. The place wrong, <laughs> just there. So it's really cool. I'm definitely um, excited about the infinite levels. Just find the shape to fit in there. And that's the uh, level complete. So yeah, that's pretty much it. You've got your tiles that you can actually rotate. You've got fixed tiles that can't rotate. And you've also got, let's see if we go here, um, just a bit of a mock menu at the moment. We've got the rewards here. So this one here is for the levels completed. This one's for your bats, amulets, and keys. And obviously these are going to be the uh, the rewards here. I've obviously not done anything with, with that yet. I'm going to have 16 rewards in total on this screen. And obviously we've got a simple instruction. That's obviously work in progress. Let me just go back. More games, there's nothing in there yet. So we'll go to play. <clears throat> when we pause it, we're going to have a Dracula asleep. And you have to sort of tap him to wake him up, we're going to have all sorts of different fun things in here as well. Uh, the possibility of adding a mini game as well to this and let's just fail here. Say we didn't like this level, we wanted to continue. We would actually be able to just skip this level. You see it's still at level 102. Um, so even though you don't like, if you don't like the look of the level you can just skip it but obviously you won't be going um, upper level, you'll still remain at 102. I'm going to plant a bomb here. <clears throat> this is going to blow up this one tile around it. We'll actually skip this level, we don't like this one either. So, like I've said, infinite levels. A little bit tricky coding it in because obviously we can't have a finished tile facing upwards on the outside. We can't have the start and finish facing uh, inwards to each other as well. So a lot of sort of coding has been done on it. Um, but yeah, really, really pleased with the results. Like I said, it's completely infinite. You can play forever. Let's see, we're just going to speed this up now. Now I've actually completed it. Move on to the next level. See, we've got two stars uh, together there. That's why they're sort of off centered. We might have different sizes instead of. Um, might have different sizes for the icons, for the collectibles, just in case they do actually overlap. But it will still pick up the two. Better get a bit of a move on here. I'm not going to be able to complete it. Ooh, it's getting tricker. Um, da -da 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 -da. I think I'm going to take the uh, easy option. Oh, he says. <laughs> I'm dead. But yeah, it's a fun game, guys. Like I said, infinite levels. Um, 
like I say, we've got a bit of coding to do with the reward system, um, instructions, and obviously uh, in this area here, 103. Got a poor screen to make, like I've said. Yeah, really happy with the results so far. Um, looking really cool. And I'll speak to you soon.